the Jonas Brothers received some backlash when they suddenly announced they are rescheduling the European leg of their tour to next year. We appreciate your love and support so much, the trio wrote on X, formerly known as Twitter. We know this is a bit inconvenient but we can't wait to share more about what's coming. The band members, which consists of Kevin Jonas, Nick Jonas and Joe Jonas, also took to social media, writing Europe. We're shifting our upcoming shows to later this year. We appreciate your love and support so much. We know this is a bit inconvenient but we can't wait to share more about what's coming. All previously purchased tickets will be honored for the new date, and info is at http colon slash slash jonasbrothers.com. More details will be sent out on email. Latin America, we can't wait to see you next week. In another video, Nick, 31, added, we have shifted the European dates to later this year, but that is only because we have some exciting projects that we're very excited to share with you at a later point. European fans, we love you, we can't wait to see you, it's been long overdue, and we're so excited to play these shows later this year in the fall. Of course fans were angry to hear the news. One person wrote, so plane tickets and hotels are free? I'm really pissed off, while another added, cancelling due to sickness slash illness or family commitments I would totally understand. But rescheduling for a project that you are prioritizing over a tour that thousands of people have paid out for, on tickets slash transport slash hotels during a cost of living crisis? Read the room please how can you all look so happy when rescheduling literally a month before the tour was meant to start? Another person asked. The short notice is gonna be hell for us to get refund for our flights and accommodations plus getting time off of work. This ain't nice. For now, the boys are still performing in Latin America, with upcoming shows in Chile, Peru, and Colombia. The pop stars have been performing since August 2023, where the tour has them performing their five albums throughout the night. Joe, 33, previously explained they are taking care of themselves while on the road. We've been burnt out before and then you're like, I still got 20 more shows on this tour, he explained to the Associated Press. So we all have our own perspective ways of going about that, and we just make sure that that's prioritized, and also that we think the three of us are communicating as best as we can. We're treating this like the best tour we've ever done, he continued. And I think we intend to make it that experience for fans as well, 